All right, so this time, doing a reaction to the legend, for at least for me, of cover artist on YouTube, Connor Maynard. And I love these videos from him. I love the sing-offs. They were probably the first video that I saw from him. Um, it's not like his most popular thing anymore. It was one of his most popular things. And I think it was when he and Alex Iono did a sing-off that I first figured out like who they both were. And I really like both of them as artists as well. Um, this sing-off is with Taylor Holder. And I don't really mess with Taylor Holder like that. I honestly don't know much about him anyway, but I don't really mess with him that much. I didn't think he could sing. So this could just be one of those, this TikTok person is really famous. Let's just get with them while their hype is here. Do a video. I don't know. I kind of hit a lot of auto-tune to be honest thing, but like, that's neither here nor there. I also have been interested in catching up on this because even though Stay has been very outplayed now because of the radio, that happens with every song, I really, I really like the song, uh, and the melody, the melody is just so good that I've seen countless remixes to it that all go down pretty well. So I don't know. I'm pretty interested to see what this is. I don't really expect much out of Taylor Holder, but like, I don't know. Let's just see. Hey, 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 Taylor, Taylor. How are you, man? You know, just, just checking in on, on my old pal. Um, dog, never met. Hey, I saw you at the boxing. <laughs> Smashed it. Thanks, I lost. Yeah, I'm pretty, yeah. Hey, a tough one. Anderson Pack. Definitely not name. Yeah, whatever. So listen. He said Anderson Pack, bro. <laughs> I don't remember who it was because I don't even... I pay some attention, but not enough to really care. Like, there was a whole Misfits thing going on, and I see all, like, the tweets about it, but I, I didn't even watch those fights. And I'm pretty sure it was either Taylor Holder or some other dude. Maybe it was Bryce Hall. Somebody was talking so much smack before their thing, and then they got bodied. I don't know if it was him or the other guy. I know I've mentioned it before, but hear me out. Sing off. Seriously, this again? Well, come on, bro. Think about it. Listen, you did the boxing. I thought I went great. Uh, but you can also sing. You know, people need to hear you sing. Dude, aren't you old? Like, you're still trying to do this. You're like 39 years old. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm 28, but... Ouch. But, dude, I don't know. If this means you'll stop calling me five times a day, then sure, I'll do it. But please, privately, I don't want to be one of those. Bro, I promise you... This audio is honestly annoying me. Like, it's all in one ear for some reason. No one will see. I don't know why that was all in one ear. That was really bothering me. Um, this is like, okay, another thing. People need to hear him sing? Debatable. Don't really know. I'm not saying the dude probably doesn't have talent, but like, come on. Eh. I don't know. I also haven't even heard him at all. So like, you know, this thing. I also don't like, I know it was a joke too. I just don't like when people be like, you know, dude, you're like, you're still doing this. You're so old. And he's like one of these 28, not old, like Simon and been doing stuff for like 10 years. They're getting to 30, but that's still not old. And it's like, these are the same people who, when like people like Taylor Holder or like me, for example, f like discovered what YouTube was or what the creative space of YouTube could be. They were the ones who set the trend for that and like paved the way for everybody to now try to go down that same avenue. So you have to give respect while they're still here doing this stuff. And that goes for everything else apart from just like YouTube. Okay. Mm, I figured this was happening. So when they said the gave the little locations, I was like, okay, are they just saying where they're from? No. So they didn't even shoot this together. And this came out freaking, this came out a year ago. So this could have been like on the edge of COVID, but even still, 
they could have recorded this together, but I guess Taylor really didn't want to do this because that's I think that's what's cooler when they even though they don't record it live, I think it's cooler when they shoot the video in the same space. And you can tell in this when they're like, you can even look at it. You can see it right there with the with the mic arm, how it's masked over this other one. Yeah, I don't know. I think that kind of kills the vibe a little bit. Heard of closing the goddamn door, no. Yeah, me if you ever care to ask. Okay. Fireflies. Yeah, we're running around. Sugar, we're going down swinging. Well, I'm blinded by the lies. No. See, and I'm not even. I did choir. I'm not a singer. I know that. I haven't done any t type of like serious vocal training or anything like that either. But I can hear that he has the either auto tune, auto correction, whatever one it is on his thing. And you also see how little he's singing by comparison. We're like, what, 30 seconds into whatever this is. Connor has now just done two own songs, like two two different songs back to back himself. And when it's been Taylor, he's done like one lyric. Blinded by the lights. No, I can't sleep until I feel your touch. Get around acting brand new. I need to tell you what to do, but try to play it cool. Baby, I ain't playing by your rules. Everything is better with a view. That looks so weird, man. Dude, I hate that. I hate that. I, I, they might as well have just shot two completely different videos and just cut between the two. Personally, I hate doing it like that. Especially if you, if you mask this mic over this one how are you then going to put his arm going behind this whole thing? And then it almost makes him look like ginormous. That looks so weird to me, man. Ugh. Also, let me backtrack and say, I'm not like hating on him for using like autotune because I know many people do that and it's not like a horrible thing. And I, and I mean, clearly like the way he's singing, it's not so blatantly obvious so that means that he can at least hold like a note or something like that um but i will still say your songs that you're picking not very diverse very very pop i know that the, it's a pop song but you can still pick some other songs from either other eras or something and still okay he's picking easy stuff that's why I love her. Listen to what's your name? Let me talk to you. Let me buy you a drink. Be with me. Okay. Nah, oh, even Connor's doing it too. There, he's a lot of these songs are being reused. I've heard him use a lot of these songs in past sing-offs, and I know these aren't live sing. If they were like live sing-offs which i don't think he's ever done then i would like cut him slack because it's like okay well off the top of your head how many pop songs can you really think that like can just easily jump into this melody or at this rhythm because you know even though there are a lot like it how many can you really think right off the rip but if for something that's like pre-recorded and like scripted beforehand you could have probably put more effort into mixing up the catalog of music that you put on this. Feel it for you. Only you can let it in. So rude. this place into the sea. The price I pay. 
I'm gonna do it again. Where does it happen? It happens after this. Look at this. You can see this. Look at this. Dude, it goes from like blank white background to this like peach color. They mask all the way to the right just so that he can stick his hand out here, man. This. Ah. Oh, 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 oh. Editor me is cringing, man. He also has like almost barely any presence as like a performer. He doesn't look comfortable. He looks like he's acting it more than like vibing and like actually feeling it, you know what I mean? The easiest part of the song. <laughs> I told you that I never would. Even when I knew I never could. Find nobody else as good as you. I need you to stay. Need you to stay. Yeah. From Santa. I ain't gonna lie. Okay, I haven't watched these in a minute. And I don't think it was because Taylor Holder was in it. But that was probably my least favorite sing off that I've heard. And to be frank, right? I'm, there's not a lot of like. <sighs> no, that's not it. Like, because I listen to them a lot. I literally probably last week listened to like three of them. The one with Alex Iono, the one with Ollie Murs. The one with, um, ah, uh, who was it? Madison Beer, right? And I mean, yes, they are all actual artists. But he's even done singles with his siblings. I'm pretty sure one of them isn't an artist per se, at least not like on his level or something. But they still did more than that. And then the video is just making me, eh. I don't know. I, I love you, Connor, but I don't think you had to do this. I don't I, I it wasn't it wasn't what I wanted. <laughs> it's just me personally. It wasn't what I wanted, but I don't know. Let me know what you guys thought in the comment section down below. Link to the original video in the description as well. Uh, make sure you guys like this video. Uh, comment down below, subscribe to the channel, click the notification bell so you get notified of future uploads like this one. Also in the description, check out my link so you get all my socials and all my other stuff that I got going on. Make sure you do all that good stuff. But um, yeah, that's pretty much all I got. Thank you guys for watching and uh, hope to see you in another video.